Hey family, hello everyone. Much love to you all. Um, I'm doing a missing person reading. And um, this young man right here, he is um, presently 26 years old. He just had a birthday, May the 9th. His name is Kevin McGuire. Man missing from Carnival Cruise in Miami. Um, it has here he's been missing since the 4th of this month of September. So here we go again. Um, another person going missing. Um, been on a cruise ship. That's crazy. Okay. And the thing about it, he's not the only one. There are others that have um, been reported missing by um, being on a cruise ship as well. So it's like, what the hell is going on, right? People going missing. Um, his case a little bit reminds me of the missing um, Tamia Taylor from Memphis, Tennessee, that went missing. I've done a reading on her about, what, nine days ago. And there are saying when it comes to Tamia Taylor, um, missing case, they had found a body, okay, um, they have to, you know, do the autopsy and find out if it's her, but, um, so my prayers to her family, but I, I did hear yesterday that they found a body, um, in the water, okay, so do your own research when it comes to that, okay, anyway, um, how can I say this, how can I say this, um, before I get started in this reading concerning the disappearance of um, Kevin um, McCarthy, um, it's not facts. We all know this. It is allegedly, and this is for entertainment purpose only, okay? I don't consider this as entertainment, but some people do watch these kind of videos as entertainment. But anyway, um, when I had a while back, let me just say this real quick. When I had a while back, did a reading on Dakali Russell, okay? I, I, I really hate to even say her name, okay? <clears throat> but I have done a reading on her a while back. Let me just say that. Um, the spread was all over the place when it comes to the energies. And I hate when that happens because it lets me know it's more to the story. Um, it's something that I need to really be looking at. It's like when they say, look over here. You know, you really, you really need to be looking over here. You know what I mean, okay? Because this is not making sense over here. It's more to the story. Something that's being manipulated. I'm getting that same energy here, okay? Like the spirit is saying, okay, you know, this ain't one thing to the public, but it's really more to this. You know, you need to look a little deeper. So that's the kind of energy that I'm getting in Kevin's um, reading as well, because I did some uh, background I did a background private reading on um, his missing case, and I don't know. It's like one and one is not adding up. So I'm, but I'm not trying to accuse anybody as far as putting out false statements or anything like that. It's just for some reason, the energy is scattered. And when it's like that, you know, uh, I have to really, really, you know, look more deeper into the individual as far as what's going on with the individual behind the scenes. They can give you an idea, you know, why things popped off the way that they did. But uh, let me say this real quick. They are saying that the sensors on the cruise ship did not go off. So as far as they're concerned, you know, Kevin did not go overboard. Um, he was supposed to... I think he was last seen by a family member at 2 a.m. that night. And they all, you know, turned the in so they can get up the next day. This is what's being said now for breakfast, but he didn't show up. And they was actually on the cruise um, celebrating his father's birthday. I think they say he turned 60 years old, his father. So, um, <clears throat> let me see here. Give me a minute, and then I'm going to get started. I promise you. I promise you. I'm just trying to see that I have a picture of him and his dad. This is the cruise ship right here. Okay? The picture of him and the cruise ship. And this right here is a picture of... I thought I had it. 
Okay, I'm not going to worry about it. I thought I had a picture of him and his dad. But anyway, he was on a boat with family. This is what I'm hearing. He was on a boat with family and friends. Okay? That's what I'm getting. What friends? Are, are these friends from his job? Or, you know, just his inner circle friends? See, I don't know any of that. I don't even know if he's in a relationship. Even though I'm getting information pertaining to relationships. But I don't, I don't even know if his lady love was with him. And he is a father. I think he's a father too. But he's a father, but I just don't know if he's presently in a relationship. Uh, as far as his partner, uh, lover, whatever, um, was with him. See, I don't know any of that, okay? Now, let's go ahead and get started with this right here. Uh, normally, I do a reading on a person. I like to do private reading, get an idea what I'm looking at. So I'm just going to share what I have. I'm going to reshuffle. I'll use my homemade deck, um, as well as I was using the Divine Shoutouts of Oracle. Shout out to Divine Vision. So let's... Let me go ahead and share what I have here, and I'm going to reshuffle, okay? I'm going to reshuffle. Let me turn the lights on real quick. Give me a minute. Okay, family. <clears throat> Thank you for being patient. Okay. I'm going to switch up. I want I have one image that's much larger. I want to use this one, the cabin. Oh boy, I never know who's watching. So before I like truly get started, I want to say much love to Kevin, McCarthy family. I'm so sorry that your loved one had disappeared. I am praying that he will be found safe and sound. No matter what comes out in this reading, I'm just an intuitive, you know, energy reader, having a gift of the spirit, and I'm just trying to shed light on any darkness that may be surrounding his disappearance. But at the end of the day, whatever comes out is not my opinion. Um, it's not facts. We all know this, okay? Um, I'm just trying to help, you know, serve and do my part. Uh, as far as what I'm picking up, as far as being led by the spirit. But whatever comes out, if you don't, you know, if it's triggering you, you know, his family and friend, if it's triggering you, you know, just don't receive it, okay? It's just that simple. Uh, no, his family didn't ask me to do this reading. I'm doing this as a labor of love, okay? I'm just trying to shed some light. Now, with that being said, um, I'm just, I'm not going to show each card. I'm just going to read them out, all right? I have here off the path of purpose, distracted. So whatever was going on with him in his personal life, um, according to the spirit, he was not focused. He was very distracted on the wrong things or on the wrong individual. But something was, was uh, holding his attention, okay? Um, I have here, now everything is, is like, in uh, this is past energy, present, future energies. Um, pretty much everything leading up to his disappearance. And it's just pretty much outcome. But anyway, other than that, they're just random messages. Uh, it has here, they are single, yes, available. It has here drama, power struggle, and conflict. So it looked like, you know, he did end up being in some kind of, you know, uh, power struggle or conflict with someone. It has here the need to own up and take full accountability for their own selfish slash negative patterns and actions. Okay. Now, when I'm, I'm using the um, Divine Shadows of Oracle, I have here selfishness, destruction, and abuse. Something about abuse. Next, I have um, something about uh, an illness. That's all I'm going to say, okay? Something about some kind of illness that he may have had. I don't know if it's like a mental illness, allegedly, or some other kind of, you know, illness um, when it comes to his health. Uh, I'm just sharing what has came out. Um, has more than one SP partner, okay? It could be pretty much seen, if he was seeing somebody, he could have been seeing somebody else. Or if he was seeing somebody, maybe that individual was seeing somebody else, you know, or could possibly be married. Anyway, in stagnation, having a hard time moving forward, has a mental conflict, 
has a new lover. Betrayal, flighty, that's someone that easily get upset, and shame, someone feeling shame. Um, when I think about betrayal, I think about somebody that you know, um, that he could have felt a sense of betrayal on that person end, okay? Um, but it came out, okay? I, I'm definitely going to reshuffle. <clears throat> Next, I have here something about um, increase resource money coming in expect money coming in so maybe this is something that he knew about or he was hoping for expecting some kind of increase or money to come in i have here the need to break up and union. so it looked like he could have been in some kind of unhealthy union Then I have know what they want and where they're going. And it has here, they are in pain within, feel sad. So like, you know, anyway, he was going through some things. He could have been experiencing depression as well, okay? Only his loved ones would know that, but that's only if he was someone that was open to talk about his feelings and his thoughts. You know, he could be someone that's, you know, very closed, uh, private, um, that doesn't discuss what's going on with him. I have here breakup, marriage ending. It may not be marriage. The key word is breakup. Something about breakup. So if he was seeing somebody, you know, he could have stopped seeing them. Okay. This could have been affecting him. But it says breakup, marriage ending. This says new opportunities coming, but being your favorite, go for it. So something about some kind of opportunity. And it has here addiction workaholic. I don't know what he does for money, but anyway, um, because your spirit, he's a work a workaholic. It has here humiliation, emotional blackmail, and explosive. I think about you know um, emotions heating up. Okay, somebody's going from one to ten. So something definitely jumping off for me to get explosive. Um, emotional blackmail. You know, someone using your emotions against you. Um, I, I call it mind effing you, if you know what I mean, because they know that you care for them. So I feel like it's somebody that he knows and care about that was affecting him also playing with his head. Let me just say that. And possibly could have been using him. But anyway, I have here also um, humiliation, feeling humiliated. And outcome, I got guilt. Somebody feeling guilty. I got the word dark. This can be a clue. He could be in a dark in, in a dark place. Um, or he could be in the dark about something, probably somebody keeping something from him. And I also have abandonment issues. And a lot of times a person like this uh, can be very domineering and controlling. So you may say, well, Corinne, what does that have to do with him, you know, um, disappearing on a cruise ship? That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> yeah. You think you, you know, you're scratching your head. I'm scratching my head, too. But I'm going to dig a little deeper. But I, I definitely want to go back over um, this right here and see what's going to come out. Okay? Using the Divine Shadows of Oracle. <clears throat> Setting my attentions on Kevin. As far as the energy that led up to his disappearance. The Spirit was pretty much giving me a lot of background Jewish information. So, um, yeah, let's uh, start over, shall we? Some clarity on the disappearance of Kevin McGar. What led up to disappearance? What led up to Kevin McGraw's disappearance? What's the shot of energy that was going on with Kevin and McGraw? I have here rejection. 
So this could have been also bothering him. I have felt rejection. Okay, what came out right here in the past energy, I have rejection, I have defiance, I have insecurities, and I have boredom. That's pretty much someone that's willing to change, and they're feeling quite restless. Moving forward in the present energy, I have a loop. That's someone's coming off very distant. I have feeling doubtful. I have arrogance, and I have drained it, like somebody that is emotionally drained and tapped out. But before in the future energy, okay, before he disappeared, I have held hostage. I think about someone, I mean, y'all see this one right here. I think about someone that feels trapped. They are in an environment or a situation they can't see a way out, okay? So for me to see held hostage, it looked like he was taken. For me to see held hostage, it looked like he was taken. Um, this doesn't look like a volunteer, you know, jumping overboard, shall I say. And, and if he did end up going overboard, let me just say that it wasn't his doing. Somebody pushed him overboard. I'm just saying. But I got held hostage, so it looked like he ended up in, in some kind of environment um, or in the path of someone that could have taken him, okay, allegedly, because I got held hostage. He's feeling trapped. I got addictions is playing a part. They're all kind of addictions. We saw one of them is pretty much a workaholic, but you know, you have sex addiction, alcohol, drugs. Next, I have here greed. So money is playing a part. And I have here antenna lighting. This one is taking things in. And I have here outcome envy. I have here brainwash. And I have desperation and I have secretive. And I don't know why, but I'm also picking up on somebody could be living a double life. <clears throat> you know, it's more to what's going on with them behind the scenes, if you know what I mean, as far as what they are into and, you know, their dealings, how they make their money. It just depends on what that means to that individual. But that's popping up also, living a double life, whatever that means to the situation. <clears throat> I'm going to reshuffle one more time. So I'm going to have disappearance of Kevin McGraw. What happened to Kevin McGraw? What led to the disappearance of Kevin McGraw? What happened to Kevin McGraw? I have here hostility. <clears throat> I have here feeling helpless. And I have here absent minded. He was not focused. Now, I can get this if you are just caught up in something, you know, having fun, you're not paying attention, you're not paying attention to your surroundings, your environment. I can get this if you are self medicating on allegedly drugs or alcohol, you know, it, uh, you're, not, you're not focused, okay? Because your mind is very cloudy and you're, and you're not using, you know, um, good judgment. Uh, this one is very distracted, okay? Period. Absent-minded. Let's continue. And um, pay attention to what came back out. Uh, you guys, y'all saw me shuffle now. 
these are key words, but it's something to it that needs to really be looked at, okay? All right, let's continue. <clears throat> right here in the past energies, I have hostility. I have insecurities. I have here defiance. I have here drains, one feeling emotionally drained. And I have here secretive, okay? Secretive. Over here in the present energy leading up to the disappearance, I have helpless, feeling helpless. I have here... Um, boredom, it's one longing for change, feeling quite restless. I have here abandonment issues. I have here rejection. Who, who's rejecting who? And I have here brainwash. Somebody playing with somebody's head with their intelligence. All right, next in the future energies moving ahead, I have absent minded, not focused. I have here a loop, someone coming off distance. This someone has got a lot on their mind, okay? <laughs> it's like they're with you, but they're not with you. They're just staring off in la-la land. Okay, I have here um, dark. The word dark is coming back out. He, he could be in a dark, you know, environment, a dark place. Or as I stated earlier, he could be in a situation to where he's in the dark about something. But that's a clue. I have here held hostage. So he was taken, possibly against his will. And he's feeling trapped. He's in an environment or a situation he doesn't want to be in. And I have desperation. Mm -hmm. You see that? Okay, down here, arrogance is playing the part. Feeling doubtful. Depression. So yes, he was experiencing depression, allegedly. And internalizing, taking things in. All right, let's switch it up. I'm going to use another um, backup that I have so I can get to the nitty gritty. But I will say this, the energy that I was getting as far as, as far as you know the possible you know outcome or what could have happened to him, family, it's like one word comes to me and that would be oh no I might, I might say two words. Two words that comes to me that I'm getting when I was doing a private reading on him is something like a false event or being conned, okay? Now, I'm, I'm going to see if any of that's going to come back out. Um, but something is off. Something is loose here. That's all I'm saying. Uh, and I'm not saying that his family is lying. You know, I'm not, I'm not saying, you know, what's been put out there. It's totally false, but something is off here because everything is alluding to, you know, the fact that something happened to him on the cruise ship. And that could be the case now. That could be the case. So I'm going to reshuffle. I'm going to reshuffle. I'm going to reshuffle. <clears throat> now, this is my opinion. Let's get started. Divine Spirit, Holy Spirit, release me to all truth and clarity by the disappearance of Kevin McCraw. We'll let you to his disappearance for all the background energy that was going on with him before he disappeared. What happened to Kevin McCraw?
this is what came back out. I'm going to reshuffle. It just says premeditated crying, being patient, and planning. I'm going to put it back in here, okay? Let me show about three more times. Y'all remember that word humiliation? It came back out right here. Okay, so when I get to this right here, check it out what it's saying when it comes to that word humiliation. Okay. <clears throat> All right, it has here. Someone sees this opportunity as a quick way to benefit and profit from. That's interesting. The Joker wanted more from the victim that they were not willing to give. They felt rejected. So that's where the rejection message come in. Okay. Now remember, it's out there. A family member of his, I believe his brother, allegedly, uh, put it out there saying that uh, he last saw Kevin um, outside of his cabin, I believe at 2 a.m. And that was it. But could it be that Kevin may have other plans? Could it be that Kevin may have met up with somebody or crossed the path with somebody once his brother turned his back and went his way? Um, sometimes things are not always what appears, what it seems, you know what I mean, okay? Anyway, let's continue. It has here, I'm going to read it again. The Joker wanted more from the victim that they were not willing to give. They felt rejected. See how keywords keep coming back out? That's what I look for. There were pictures taken, and that is true. There were pictures taken of Kevin on the dance floor. I think he was at a casino, I believe, but he was definitely um, seen uh, with his uh, family members, okay? Now, a lot of this is throwing me off. I ain't going to lie to you, but I'm just a messenger, okay? I'm trying to connect the, you know, connect the dots myself. It has here a crime of passion, attacking spouse or partner, lover, when caught cheating, retaliation, assaulting them. Now, let me say this real quick. I was picking up on something about somebody being married. I don't know if Kevin's married or not. Let me just say that. But could it possibly be that he crossed paint with somebody he could have been flirting and they could have been married and maybe, maybe his spouse found out about it. Uh, I'm just saying, because I'm getting this right here. Unless he's married. And so far, I haven't heard anything about him being married. It says a crime of passion, attacking spouse or partner, lover, when caught cheating, retaliation, um, assaulting them. Because I am getting something about someone could possibly be married. Now, I don't know if it's a background energy as far as you know, he could be seeing somebody behind the scenes. I don't know. Okay? I'm just a messenger. 
Okay, next, made a bad choice around the wrong crowd, foolish. Next, I'm tired of the games and being lied to, moving on. And remember, we did see manipulation. Manipulation. Uh, we saw um, brainwash, okay? Somebody's mind helping you. Well, sent out to me with this right here. Um, I think about that he's somewhere possibly could be abandoned somewhere. Um, I'm going to say alone somewhere, okay? Whether it's of his own doing, walking away, uh, being alone, or he could have been um, dropped off, abandoned somewhere, okay? It's an abandoned building, but it's the key words I look for, all right? It's the key words I'm looking for. But I, I do have the word abandoned here. That's right. His says, this was a humiliation, crime, shame. And we did see the word shame also. This was a humiliation, crime, shame them, getting them back, revengeful. Now, two words came out. That's humiliation and shame when I had used the um, divine shadow deck. Okay, check this out. This is more, this is past, present, and future. It has here was used to benefit someone else. Negative negative selfish agenda and i was picking up something about you know kevin being used but he was used for somebody else selfish negative agenda or they had you know other intentions towards him it has here a well-known landmark in the area whether it's a tower a statue a bridge or a wall Okay, so these are some possible locations he could be, whether he's alive or not. He's near some kind of landmark, whether it's a tower, a statue, a bridge, or a wall. This is where he could be, whether he's hanging out there or, you know, if he is in water, I'm just saying allegedly, his body could, you know, you know resurfacing in an area like this. It's right here says near a construction site hidden. So it might be an area to where they're still working on it. But you see what I'm saying? It's, it's, it's like I'm not getting that, you know. It seemed like whatever, I, whatever jumped off with him, you know, it pretty much happened off the boat as well. Okay. Question when a family member throws stones and hide their back. So it's like a family member could possibly know something. It's a question when a family member throws stones and hides their back. So that's interesting. It has here rage, violent, and uncontrolled anger. And remember we saw the message um, explosive. You know, something jumped out. I can hear dogs barking in the background. See, this is off the boat. Unless you can carry your pet with you on the boat, on a cruise boat. And it has here drowned in water. So it's a good chance, you know, um, Kevin um, is in water, allegedly. Now, let me say this also. Now, according to the cruise ship, they're saying that they had sensors on the boat, meaning these sensors were working um, and it can detect if a person is going overboard, but these sensors did not go off. So now I'm wondering, you know, is this a cover up due to the fact that something jumped off on this boat? Just saying. And, you know, this so their so-called sensor did not go off. Their so-called sensor did not detect it, whether Kevin jumped off the boat Willingly or not, somebody could have thrown him off the boat. Just saying. But like to me, he got into with somebody. I'm picking up on the fact that he met up with somebody also. That's coming to me also. So now I'm wondering with these so-called friends, 
you know, did he have some kind of friends that were there and they could have been married? Just saying. Did he have any kind of friends that was joining the family, celebrate his father's uh, birthday? Okay, that he could have been attracted to, you know, and maybe the part, maybe the spouse found out about it. That you know, I'm getting that for some reason, but popping up in my spirit that he met up with somebody. Okay, because I'm getting also in my spirit surprise visit. That's what popping up also when somebody came to his cabin or he went to there, you know, or crossed paths with an individual. So yeah, that's what I'm getting. There's more to the story. That's all I'm saying. I don't I don't really think this is pretty much like a fake story, but how the events have played out is to me what needs to be said is not said. That's the point I'm trying to make. What needs to be said is not said. It's more to a story. And I feel like what's not what's not said is pretty much to where he won't look in he won't Kevin won't look in the bad light. He's probably missing. Nobody's trying to see Kevin in a bad light, okay? I don't, I'm not trying to see him in a bad light, but what I see here, he's presently missing. But something jumped off with him, you know? Something jumped off. And the cruise company, they're going to cover their asses. That's their company. You know, they don't want to look in a bad light. You know, I also heard that, you know, the, uh, the passengers that were on the cruise ship, they didn't find out uh, once it docked the next day. That's when they found out somebody was missing. But, uh, you know, I've seen videos of one of the passengers pissed off because she's like, well, how come they didn't let us know? You know, we could have been out looking for him, searching for him. But see, the cruise ship company didn't let nobody know that he was missing. Uh, make that make sense. I mean, I mean, why, why wait that out? I mean, I mean, why hold out that kind of information? See, they don't want to be looking a bad light and they sure don't want to be sued. So anyway, I tell you. All right, family, I apologize. <clears throat> My daughter making a little too much noise. All right, let me turn this around real quick. Let me go ahead and reshuffle. Okay, family, <clears throat> I think I'm going to end it on this note. Just know that when I'm doing a reading on a person, normally this doesn't happen when the energies are scattered, okay? Um, 
a lot of time when energies are scattered when I'm doing a reading, it can be due to some kind of fraud. Uh, the story people are putting out there is not really the way things went down, if you know what I mean. So I will see things from a different perspective other than what the story is being told, if you know what I mean. Uh, if, if, somebody's, if somebody's into witchcraft, they don't, and, you know, they'll try to you know, tap into those kind of energy to protect them, you know, to blind the readers, if you know what I mean. Uh, the energy can be scared as well. <clears throat> it has happened before. Um, there are many reasons. Let me just say that why the energy can be scattered. Or shall I say what needs to be said is not said. So it's more to the story. I look at things like that also. When I'm getting a lot of background Jewish information about an individual. All I know is, you know, this brother was on a cruise ship with his family members and he disappeared. Okay. Um, they checked his cabin and he was not there. And um, I'm hearing there are no cameras on the ship. <clears throat> so anyway, family. Um, I let y'all be the judge. I'm praying for Kevin's safe return. I'm going to go over the information that I'm receiving, okay? And you can see why I'm saying the energies are all over the place. Okay. This came out, but I I, I don't feel the need to share this information. I don't want him to look in a bad light, okay? Even though it's allegedly. But I will say this. It says something about sexual acts, okay? That's all, it's, that's all I'm going to say. It's mentioning something about sexual acts. That's all I'm going to say, okay? That, that's all I'm going to say. It has here wrong path, dangerous environment. It has here waiting on trash pickup dumpster, whatever that means, okay? And, and like I said, well, why would that come out if something jumped off on the boat? You feel me? Okay, let's continue. It has here, being paranoid, you are being threatened in some way. And I also can, I also, you know, um, picking up on something about, you know, somebody want him to stay away from something or someone, if you know what I mean. So anyway, being paranoid, you are being threatened in some way. I have here, a closer observation of the victim living space may provide more clues. I have here stranded, left, dropped off, abandoned, helpless. I'm going to show you this right here. A lot of these keywords are coming right back out. See that? See on the bottom? Okay, moving on. It has here, not alone. They are being watched. It has here made a detour change of plans. It has here the lovers. Now, is it talking about Kevin and his so-called secret lover or his lover period? Or is it talking about somebody that he could have been seen on the side, being secretive? You know, the lovers, you know, the husband and wife or two people that are in relationship. You know, uh, all I know is I'm getting the lovers. Possibly secret lovers. It has here on the go travel. I'm getting this right here. It has here, this is what I do for you versus what I don't get back in return. So I think about someone that's, you know, doing for somebody, but the energy is not reciprocated, if you know what I mean. So that's somebody that's feeling used due to what they're doing for someone versus what they're not getting back in return. Okay, it just says highway, it says near highway. What comes to me, I think about um, highway, bridge, overpath. That's what comes to me, like a highway, bridge, overpath area, allegedly. Um, next, I have here, in a toxic, unhealthy union, being abused and controlled. And I still think about somebody trying to use you, you know, effing with your mind, trying to get you to see things their way so they can control you as far as what they can get out of, you know, being with you. I have here drinking. I'm drinking. I have here using them, hooking up for benefits, financial gain. I have here self-sabotage due to the past negative thinking and action caught up with them karma. 
And I have here good old scam. Scam fraud watch for. But I don't know why this would come out. You know, what, what, is, this, what is this all about? It's a scam and fraud. Maybe somebody was trying to scam and fraud him. You know, maybe it's not so much the public is being a scam and fraud due to the story. Maybe it could be somebody was trying to scam him. And it just says outside city limits. What, what stands out to me is outside. Oh, boy. It has here in the crossfire of others beef and drama. It has here don't want to be exposed, being secretive, my business. I think about somebody living a secret life or a double life. It's more to them, what's going on with them behind the scenes. It has here competition, beef and drama over the same one standing their ground. I think about two individuals, you know, they're in competition for one person, you know, uh, objective of interest. I have here question their furniture, bed, dresser, or couch. Um, Someone furniture, look deeper and closer or inside. That's interesting. Or inside. Question their furniture, furniture, whether it's a bed, a dresser, or a couch. Someone furniture, look deeper and closer or inside. That's interesting right there. Not sure what that's about. It has her drugs. <clears throat> And I have here, check under the floor, there's something hidden, whatever that means. But see, you know, a lot of this is blowing my mind because, you know, the energy to me is pertaining to something that's going on out. How can I say this? The energy to me, it, it looks like something jumped off, off the boat. You feel me? Now, think about it. I mean... It says question this. It says there. Like, I think about that's somebody's personal, you know, item. You know, their bed, their dresser. You feel me? Um, Check under the floor. You know, there's something hidden. You know, is, is it something hidden, you know, under the floor at the cruise ship? Or is it something hidden? Where, you know, it just depends on the environment he's in. You know, at his home. See, I don't know. That's what I mean. The engines are scattered. It's very scattered. You know, even though all this is allegedly, I'm still getting a, a lot of, you know, behind the scenes energy. Um, like I said, I don't I don't know if Kevin, you know, had a, a girlfriend or not. I know he has children, but I don't know if he's still seeing his children's mother or it was he just solo doing him dating. You know, allegedly he could have been seeing somebody married. Um, that can be the case. Um, but somehow he's ended up in the well, allegedly, 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 it's looking like he had ended up in the water. I'm gonna say, I'm gonna say it that way, okay? Allegedly, it's looking like he had ended up in the water, okay? All right, this is my last time shuffling, and I promise I'm gonna end this reading. I'm putting all this back in the deck and see what's gonna come back out. And this is what I go by. I look for repeated messages, okay? So right here, I'm going to reshuffle and see what's going to come back out. Now, I'm, I'm going to continuously shuffle. Uh, I just want to show you what came out. This says question roommate, whether he shared that cabin with somebody or where he lived, where he actually lived, okay? It's a question roommate. And I just say feeling numb, taking self-medication, drugs, or alcohol. So it looked like there was some drinking. And also possibly, you know, he could have been allegedly indulging uh, either self-medicating or taking something, okay? And like I said, it could be prescription. I don't know.
Before I leave the cards out, I'm going to show you what came back out. Someone sees this opportunity as a quick way to benefit and profit from. So if you look at it like, you know, from the perspective of is this a scam, maybe he's alive and somebody's trying to profit from his disappearance, you know, that's pretty much the way it's looking, okay? Like, when I say something like this, I think about somebody laying low, okay? They're laying low, they're hiding out, and they want things to look a certain way. That's what I'm getting when I look at this right here. You know, this could let me know there's a good chance he could still be alive laying low. But then I saw the message drowned in water. So maybe in one particular timeline, he was laying low, and then maybe something could have jumped off, you know? But anyway... It came back out. Okay, I'm getting ready to end this reading. I think y'all feel love supporting my channel. Um, <clears throat> the way this is looking, um, it's more to the story, family. That's all I'm going to say. And I'm praying for Kevin's safe return back to his loved ones. That's all I'm going to say. The energies to me are very scattered. And when, when they're like this, it's just more to the story, okay? We have to let things play out. So a lot of information came back out. And you saw I shuffled, I shuffled, I shuffled. This is what came back out, okay? Even though it might not make a lot of sense, because we're looking like he disappeared on the boat, but it looked like it's more to the story. It has here, someone sees this opportunity as a quick way to benefit and profit from, and I shared this earlier, okay? Next. <clears throat> this is what I do for you versus what I don't get back in return. So I think about somebody doing somebody a favor, but they feel like they're getting the end of the stick, if you know what I mean. You know, what they want in return, they're not getting it. I think about somebody doing somebody a favor, but they didn't profit or benefit from it. They're being used. Okay, next. In the crossfire of others, beef and drama. Not alone, they are being watched. It just depends on if it's like a past energy or a present energy. I don't know. It says not alone, being watched. But I am picking up on something happened, okay? I have your drugs. Drugs is playing the part. Using them, hooking up for benefits. And financial gain. Now you see that? That's, that's background Jewish information. Let's continue. May a detour change a plan. Did this happen once he got off the boat? But I don't know why he would get off the boat and, and not let his loved ones know. Made a detour change of plans. It has your highway. You see, I'm, you see what I'm saying, family? Near highway. Don't want to be exposed. Being secretive, my business. So he could be someone that's very, very private. And I think he's a, I think he used to be in the military also. He's, he's an ex-veteran. Um, it has here... Check under the floor. There's something hidden. What floor? Whose floor? The cruise 
cabin floor or his floor at home? Whose floor? See how it didn't keep coming back out. Self sabotage due to the past negative thinking and actions caught up with them. It says with them, karma. I think about self sacrifice about the wrong kind of individual was used to benefit someone else. Negative, selfish intentions. The spirit is saying that he was used to benefit somebody else. Negative, selfish intentions. It's like somebody's property or somebody's going to benefit from his disappearance. And maybe it could have been like a con, but something went to the left. I have here the lovers. The lovers. Who is this? Is this Kevin and somebody? Who is that? Or is it a couple? This is allegedly, I'm just a messenger. Uh, I'm, I'm going to show it and I'm not going to say it. It's allegedly, okay? I'm not accusing anybody of doing anything. I'm, I, I don't know why this came out, but, but what stands out to me is something about sexual acts, okay? It has here competition, beef, and drama over someone standing their ground. It says over someone, competition. And it has here in a toxic, unhealthy union, being abused and controlled. It's like he let somebody just walk all over him. And he's not, you know, standing up for himself. But if he wasn't focused, uh, if you're helpless, they can be due to the fact of, you know, uh, possibly allegedly high on substance. If somebody can be getting over on him. I have here scam and fraud, watch for. Now, if it's not us public to watch for scam and fraud due to his story, it can be that he needs to watch for scam and fraud. Somebody trying to get over on him. Wrong path, dangerous environment. See how my messages repeat, family? And, and look, uh, uh, it's a lot that could have came out. Please know that. It's a lot more that could have came out. But look what's repeating. It has his drinking. There was some drinking. And there are pictures out there of him, you know, having fun with his family member, you know, drinking, you know, having a good time, listening to music, partying. It has here waiting on trash pickup dumpster. Why would this be the case? You know, what, what is it somebody would have that they feel the need to get rid of? Is it evidence on a boat? Something could have been in the trash can? Made a bad choice around the wrong crowd, foolish. Now I ask the question, what crowd? You with your family members and some friends. And then this says on the go travel. Now you can say he's present on the go travel, or maybe this is just or maybe this is just alluding to the fact that he's on that boat, you know, uh traveling. It could be that, okay? On the go travel on that boat, because he was on a cruise boat. Question their furniture, such as bed. Dresser or couch. Someone furniture. Look deeper and closer inside. It says inside their furniture. And it just says outside city limits, okay? So, <sighs> excuse me, family. I can't make information come out for the hell of it. Uh, I'm getting a lot of background information. Uh, allegedly that's pertaining to what was going on with, you know, Kevin behind the scenes. Um, but something did come out earlier about, you know, drowned um, in the water. That did come out. It doesn't mean he's in water. Uh, now, now you see what I mean when I get messages that are scattered. You know, I'm looking, I'm looking for one thing, but I'm getting something totally different. And I have to stand on it because this happened also when I did the reading on the Carly Russell. You notice I'm saying the beginning, okay, I'm like something is up because my energies are, energies are scattered. And this reading, you know, I could put my hand on it because whatever that was going on behind the scenes with her, just saying it, it was nothing pertaining to, you know, abduction. You, you feel me? You know, we saw pictures of her car 
pulling over and all of that, you know, outside of the highway or the ramp. Um, but it was all made up. Okay. And, I, and I'm not saying this is made up or anything, but the energy are kind of scattered that way. It's like, I'm getting a lot of, you know, um, energies. That's a lot of energy to me. is like, what's going on with him behind the scenes? Um, as far as what could be affecting him being missing in the present, you know, due to him crossing the path with somebody, um, or involved with somebody. All I know is somebody was trying to get over on, I'm getting scammed and calling and all of that. You know, uh, something being planned. Maybe things, maybe things didn't go as planned. Um, I was also, I was also picking up on, you know, meeting up with somebody. So, you know, for me to get that, and I, and I truly, you know, believe what Spirit is conveying to me. You know, who was he meeting up with? That is the question. He, he's on the boat. He's with family and friends, so who are these friends? You know, are these friends anybody he works with, or you know, are any of them, you know, his ex? Uh, see, I don't know. He, he crossed paths with somebody, a stranger on the boat he was attracted to, and meet up with them, couldn't find out they could have been involved with somebody else. See, I don't know. Or possibly married. All I know is the energy is all over the place. It, it's not like it's cut and dry. You know, he's having fun on the boat. You know, um, he may cross paths with a stranger. They're fighting and, you know, drown in water. You know, kind of leading towards that. His breathing, his energy is all over the place. It's all over the place. Now, I tell you what, this is the last time. I mean, I'm going to show up four times. I'm going to show up for four good times, okay? <clears throat> Anything Spirit wants to know concerning the disappearance of Kevin McCarthy? All right, I'm ready to end this. Cause the more I'm shuffling, additional information is coming out, and it's like a darn rabbit hole. So when it's, when it's like that, um, I've done all that I can do. How long, family?
All right, let's get with it. I'm just going over what came out, okay? <sighs> Allegedly. Someone sees this opportunity as a quick way to benefit and profit from repeated message. Stranded. Left, dropped off, abandoned, helpless. Need medical attention, a health professional. So, you know, something did happen to him. Agent, someone is helping the other to cover up the suspect crime. <sighs> Alert third party involved, victim, joker, suspect, and other stranger. Hold on, family. My little queen getting a tutu rowdy rowdy. I'm going to go over this again. Alert third party involved. Victim. That would be Kevin. Okay, it has here, let me see, Joker, suspect, and other stranger. I think about like associate. Third party involved. Okay. I don't know why that picture keeps going off anyway. It has here... Um, this is what I do for you versus what I don't get back in return. So it looked like he, it looked like he was expecting to profit and benefit in some way, but you know, what he was expecting to get back in return, you know, he didn't get it. And I think that's where the con is coming in at. He was con. See, okay. I told you guys secretly meeting up with someone. Now, what I want to know is, was Kevin secretly meeting up with someone on the boat, okay? Or did he get off the boat, unbeknownst to his family member, and uh, met with somebody? That is the question. It says secretly meeting up with someone. It has here, caution, the need to remove themselves from negative toxic person or groups. It says person or groups. And I'm going to show you what, what came out. Look at that. So this something's going on with him behind the scene. It's a groups. See that groups? What's, what's that all about? It has here. Um, now this says house cleaning, cover up, rid of evidence. You see how the energy is looking like something jumped off, like off the boat. That, that's what's not making sense to me. Unless this is just past energies, but it's it's just. The engine's all over the place. This says um, uh, money, the motive. Something about money. Somebody, somebody was expecting to profit from this. And maybe Kevin was in on it, allegedly. But it like it backfired on him. Something backfired. He was being used. It has here being paranoid. You are being threatened in some way. A private family matter got out of hand. Drama slash envy. Family rivalry. Allegedly. In the crossfire, caught up in the drama. Okay, I'm, I'm going to tell y'all what's coming to me now. Okay, I'm, I'm going to tell y'all what's coming to me. Can I be wrong? Absolutely. Remember, we saw the message. Hold on a minute. Let me pull up Kevin's picture. Hold on. Hold on. Give me a minute. Now, I'm going to say something. A lot of times when, when things pop up in my spirit, I like to talk about it. I like to talk about it no matter how far-fetched it may be, okay? But it'll pop it up in my spirit now. Let me say this real quick. 
It's a good chance Kevin might be a liar, okay? Hidden somewhere. Um, at first, we, we were getting the message uh, dropped off, abandoned. Um, we also got the message, uh, and alone, and I mean, we also got the message that he could be with somebody, somebody's watching him, right? Kyle, what's coming to me is, um, what's coming to me is taken, okay? But anyway, make a long story short, the point I'm trying to make is, I'm seeing this right here, and I'm like, what the hell is this about? Because now the messages are really just going left field, but there might be something to it, allegedly. Remember we saw the message drowned in water. Remember that? Now, sometimes I can get a message that will come out like that, family. I talk about smoke and mirrors. It's not like the spirit is trying to confuse me. It's a good chance he could be in water and he could have drowned. Let me just say that now. But also, because the possibility, maybe that's what people want somebody to think that he's in water and he's drowned. Okay? Maybe somebody may want to think Maybe 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 somebody may want us to think that he drowned in the water. That can be a possibility also, but unbeknownst to us, the public, something really jumped off from another perspective or in another location. All right? Now, I'm not accusing his family of lying or anything as far as the story that they're telling, but this stays right, this stays near or on one of their family member property hidden. That was just a saying. Now, it might not be his family member. It can be maybe somebody that might be involved. It can be on one of their family members' property hidden. But also, I keep thinking about in water drowned. Now, that can happen if he was, if he was intoxicated and falling overboard. You know, I can see that. But I'm picking up on the fact that he had got into it with somebody, okay? If I was saw the word con and power struggle and conflict and all of that. Uh, it's a good chance he might not be in the water. I'm just saying he, he might not be in the water. He might not be in the water. Only time would tell. I always say that things play out, but sometimes when my energies are scattered, it's more to the story. That's all I'm trying to say. You know, the way the events are out there, you know, it's like Spirit is saying, well, you need to look at this right here, okay? Now, this says near or near or on one of their family members' property hidden. And then this says they are alive and well. But maybe that can be in this particular timeline, he was alive and well. You know, I don't know if he's, if he's still with, her, with, us, with us or not, okay? Then this says paranoia in fear for their life. Someone's out to hurt or unalive them. So this letting me know that he, he was in paranoia. You know, thinking somebody was out to get him. And it's really due to what's going on with him behind the scenes as far as what he was into, you know. Um I feel like I feel like this right here is a clue. What stands out to me is remote location. It says off a walking trail close by a creek area, remote location. That would stand out to me more than anything. It's pretty much you somewhere isolated alone and nobody's around, okay? A closer observation of the victim living space may provide clues. And this came back out. It says the victim living space. Or, you know, maybe it's a cabin. And it's right here says, feels control. Once my power back, I want out. Right here he's saying, I want out. So, anyway, I'm through with this. I, obviously, it, 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 something. I feel like something did happen to him. Let me just say that because I'm seeing this right here. All right? You know, need medical attention. I'm seeing this right here. So, something happened to him. And I feel like, you know, whatever jumped out, he was being used. Um... Somebody concocted some kind of scam that went to the left. And um, I would love to believe that he's still alive and with us. But family is more to the story, okay? Could he be in water? Absolutely. Because I did get that in the beginning, you know, in water, drowned, you know. But if he is drowned, somebody did something to him. That's all I'm saying. You know, I don't. I just don't see him high and walking around and falling over the boat. Um, it's more to the story because I'm getting energies of off the boat. You know, we're talking about his furniture, 
You know, what is what does his furniture or any clues pertaining to his living space have to do with what happened to him on the boat? The energy is scattered. And when it's like that, it's more to the story. That's all I'm saying. So with that being said, much love to Kevin. Much love to his family. I pray your loved one will be found no matter what. Because it's nothing like not knowing. And I've seen lots of love and light. Kevin Way. He will find his way back to his loved ones. And um, this is a doozy. This one is a doozy. It is a doozy. Okay? That's all I got to say. It's more to the story. So anyway... Uh, much love to you, family. Thank you for watching. Uh, come to your own conclusions. None of this was my opinion. I was just interpreting what I was picking up being led by the Spirit, okay? But it's definitely more to the story. And the fact that I saw the message meeting up with somebody, come on now. Who is he meeting up with? If it's not a family member, who is he meeting up with? A so-called friend, a secret friend, and then we saw the word lover. All right. I'm out of here. Peace and love and bye for now. May more information comes to the light within the coming days and weeks on the disappearance of Kevin for his family's sake. Peace.